What's up, y'all? Pete's here. Doing a little experimentation this morning. Trying some pyrolysis on some integrated circuit chips to get it to gold on the inside. Put the chips inside of a small soup can, then put the small soup can inside of a larger soup can. That keeps the oxygen from getting to it. You can see the fire coming out of there. That's the VOCs, volatile organic compounds, gassing out. And it'd be a lot cleaner if I had an afterburner on it, but hey, only got so much. When it gets through with the process, I should be left with ashes and the metal and silicon guts of the chips. With the magic editing, you'll see what happens. Here's the results from the experiment, and it worked. Basically what happened is it cooked out all the plastic. The stuff that could burn in the plastic turned into the gas form, and that's what was burning in, in the fire earlier. Now what you're left with is carbon from the plastic and whatever the other components are. It's more ceramic-y sounding now, but this is the cool thing about it. Watch this. See? Makes it really easy to get to the stuff inside. Pretty, 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 pretty. And the chip fell off in there somewhere. But if you want to reclaim the stuff yourself from the chips, pyrolysis is your friend. And to get some more info on that stuff, look up how to make biochar. YouTube has some cool videos about that. But it works. See ya.